the morning. It's about 6.45 and I'm starting my trek up to Ben Lomond Peak the long way via North Skyline Trail. I've lived in Utah eight, nine years and I've never done this one, so here we go. Okay, at 1.5 miles, and I'm at this awesome overlook spot. Check this out. Oh, so pretty. That's Powder Mountain up there and Pine View Reservoir out there. So far, I'm really liking this. It's just really long switchbacks, but it's probably 45 or 50 degrees, so it feels awesome. I would not want to do this in the middle of the summer or middle of the heat. Loving these skies. I'm at 4.6 miles and I left the trail and I'm on the saddle leading up to Chili Peak. I also wanted to check that one off my list. It's not too far off the main trail, um, almost to the summit of that one. All right, just made it to Chili Peak. I'm basically at five miles, 4.94, and that's Ben Loman up there, my destination for the day. Supposedly it's another three and a half, four miles from here, but it seems a lot closer. Views up here are awesome, no wind at all. Oh man, I picked a perfect day to do this. This is great. So I was going to try and just keep going straight down over the summit and catch the trail, but it looks like a pretty steep rocky drop off with loose talus so I don't feel comfortable doing that by myself and I've never done this trail before so I don't really know where to drop in um, so I'm just gonna walk back down to the saddle and catch the main trail I mean it's only gonna add on another 0.3 miles um, but I just feel safer especially by myself back on the main trail Well, I'm glad I didn't try and drop down because it was a cliff wall. That would have not been fun to get down. So definitely turn around and go back down to the saddle once you're getting off Chili Peak. Seven miles and two hours 50 minutes I'm um, at the major trail split and what we're gonna do is head up to Ben Loman right here um, and it's just switchbacks the entire way for the next 1.4 miles so it's time to start climbing
what an awesome day. Finally up here on the summit of Ben Loman Peak. So trail stats for today were 8.5 miles one way, 3,600 feet elevation gain. And it took me just over three and a half hours just at a casual hiking pace. And that was including Chili Peak. Um, so if you skip that, it'll shave off about half a mile and maybe 100, 200 feet or so. I um, got all my stuff ready to go to run down, so I'm hoping it won't take near as long. Make sure you check out my trail guide linked below, as well as some discount codes for Gaia GPS, snacks, and some other good gear. We'll see you guys next time.